morning and welcome to Dub C T V. Happy Monday. I am Mealy Daniel. And I'm Debrielle Washington. Today's school announcements. Please come out and support the mid-year graduation today. Report cards have been delayed till February the 12th due to late exam results. That's all for our school announcements. Now to Mealy for the world news. <laughs> Texas state lawmakers under fire for a divisive Facebook post asking Muslim visitors attending an event at the state capitol in Austin to pledge allegiance to the United States. When Heather Choi was 10 weeks pregnant with her sixth child, she received devastating news, a breast cancer, a breast cancer diagnosis. Doctors advised Choi, 29 years old, to end her pregnancy to save her own life, but she refused, saying she'd rather die. On January 6, Carrie Celeste was born completely healthy. Later that same month, the Colorado-based Choate family learned that Heather was cancer-free. Isn't that ironic? Very. This That's all for World News. <laughs> Check out our motivational clip on this marvelous Monday. It has been said that most people fail in life not because they aim too high and miss, no. Most people fail in life because they're just like I was for 14 years. They aim too low and hit, and many never aim at all. They just go through life surviving. How you live your life, how I live my life, how all of us live our lives, is a result of the story we believe about ourselves. We become what we think about. All of us are self-made, but only the successful will admit it. In order to be successful, you must be willing to do the things today others won't do in order to have the things tomorrow others won't have. Your mind is a machine. You must program yourself for success. You've got to believe in yourself. See, ladies and gentlemen, life is too short. It's too short and unpredictable being miserable. Here's the thing. There's no safe position in life. So you've got to be bold in life. You've got to take life on. If you want it, you got to go get it. You got to play hard for it. It's not for the weak and the uncommitted. Sometimes it's going to hurt. Sometimes it's going to be painful. Sometimes you're not going to be able to walk. Sometimes when I'm running on that treadmill, I don't feel as good as I normally feel. My leg hurts. Sometimes I'm sick. But this is, this is a physical sport. And if you want it, you got to go get it. You got to play hard for it. Innovation is rewarded. Execution is worship. This is what it is, okay? Empty your mind. Be formless, shapeless, like water. Now you put water into a cup, it becomes the cup. You put water into a bottle, it becomes the bottle. You put it in a teapot, it becomes the teapot. Now water can flow or it can crash. Be water, my friend. Be first and last. Be first to attack and last to counter. Be first to wake and the last to sleep. Be first to meet challenges and the last to hide from them. Be first to learn from your mistakes and the last to give an excuse. Be first to claim victory and last to settle for defeat. Be first to sweat, sacrifice, and suffer for your goals and dreams, and you will be the last one standing at the top of the mountain called achievement. It's hard, yep, it's difficult, yep, because the process is weeding out the weak. It's weeding out the weak. And so sometimes you got to play hard, you got to play physical, you got to play tough, because the game itself is tough. The game itself is hard. But I know you got what it takes not to quit, not to give up, not to give in. And I will not give up, and I will not give in until I get to that day. I will not stop. I will not give up. I will not give in. I need you to wake up every day and say, today ain't the day, but my day coming. And I will not give up until my day comes. This week's Man Crush Monday is a platinum selling record artist Drake, who is getting ready to release his album Six God.
Did you know Black History Month began in, as a Negro History Week, which is, was created in 1926 by Carter G. Woodson, a noted African American historian? It became a month long celebration in 1976. The month of February was chosen to coincide with the birthdays of Frederick Douglass and Abraham Lincoln. Today's inspirational quote is, the ambitious climbs up high and perilous stairs and never cares how to come down. The desire of, fa Blah. The desire of rising hath swallowed up his fear of a fall. Thomas Edison. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Millie Daniel. And I'm Debrio Washington. See you Wednesday.